what happens when he doesn't want them to. <laughs> So I stumbled upon this video, it's called Incredible Akaido Master Steven Seagal beats his opponent with only a pinky finger. I was, when I saw the title, I was like, there's just no way in heck. And they literally, in the video, is like hyping him up. Like he's that dude. Watch, watch, watch. Rich, we're about to see an Aikido Master hold off the strength of two men using only his little finger. Now we're at an Aikido Dojo or school. And the quiet we're experiencing is the first step in preparation for their amazing display of the powers of the mind. This is Steve Seagull, the only non-Japanese Aikido master ever in the history of Japan to own and operate an Aikido school on Japanese soil. Although what you're about to see may seem very physical indeed, watch closely and you will detect the difference between Aikido and other martial arts. Notice that the master is merely defending himself, turning aside his attackers while exerting very little counterforce of his own. <laughs> I'm only laughing because he literally, the dude, they gotta be overacting because like, they run up, he just... They're like, ah, the like, like they literally get, they literally are WWE acting for this man, bruh. And the, and the person is literally believing it, whoever is the reporter is, bruh. It's like the one with the dude chops. He's like, he's like, he's like, he's gonna chop 20 b uh, bricks. And like, and then the reporter actually smacks him. He's like, what the? I actually felt these bricks. These are real bricks. I mean, there's, there's no joke. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. <laughs> In Aikido, basically speaking, there is no punching, there is no kicking, there is no blocking, there is no collision. Aikido is basically being able to be one with the universe, be one with nature, so that you can therefore sense the intention of your attacker. Here. Aikido works on a philosophy of positive versus negative energy. Oh my an goodness. An aggressive act, such as an attack upon an innocent person, is negative force. Defense is positive. And according to Aikido, we'll always win as long as one remains in contact with the universe. The power of the Aikido master lies in an accumulation of ki, the power of mind. But it can be deadly when applied directly. Aikido, or being one with the universe, <laughs> produces produce some unbelievable results. We don't know how the power works, but we're about to see it demonstrated even more dramatically. The man was literally tapping out, and here's the Aikido master. Die, he died for this demonstration. And the dude was like, oh, ow. oh my god! And then the reporter in the background, yo, this is too priceless, bro. This is all so funny, bro. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, bro. He's he's physically doing nothing. This is WWE at its finest. Oh my gosh, bro. There's just no way a heck this is a thing, bro. Now, preparing to demonstrate the sheer power of his mind. As you can see, two black belt students on either side of him can easily pick him up off the ground. But look what happens when he doesn't want them to. Uh. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> the acting is 10 out of 10. This man looks like he is he's about to roll like roundhouse kick you, bro. That's what he looks like, bro. And I like how he's looking down like, yeah, I'm him. In reality, they're literally not even trying to pick him up. They're just overacting, bro. <laughs> this is one of the fun. And then look. Dramatic indeed. Using only his little finger. Oh my goodness, this is so funny, bro. This gotta be the most fakest video on earth, bro. <laughs> they should also add the dialogue with absolutely no struggle at all. It, it's almost as if it's fake. <laughs> They 
no special stances in Aikido. You just stand passively, wait for the attack, and make your move. It's as quick and easy as saying, you ask. If you can do it, anyone can. What? What? You ask for it. Sayonara, rich son. Bro, that guy tapped out, and Steve just kept on choking him. <laughs> Steve Seagal is like an NPC who gains sentinia and self-importance. <laughs> Took the sheer power of my mind not to dislike this. <laughs> I love how unimpressed the studio is. Bro, the, the guy who folded himself in half pretending to get knocked down by Steve is a true hero of this. Dude, this video is just so funny, bro. I think it's all fake, but bruh. That is least so funny, like staged, like it's for the channel. But honestly, it's still one of the funniest things to stumble upon. Actually, I think it's actually real. Oh my gosh. That makes it 10 times more funnier, bruh. Alright guys. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all did, don't forget to do the three things. Like, subscribe, and what? Hit that bell notification for your boy, Dil Dylan Aquina, bruh. I'll see y'all later, dill dill pals and gals. Konnichiwa!